If your Razer Rip Rider or Flash Rider are anything like mine, then they've got a lot of wear and tear on them. I've already replaced the front wheel on one of these, but in this video I'm going to replace the rear caster wheels on the red Flash Rider. These are pretty much identical tricycles, so this tutorial applies to the Rip Rider as well. So let's flip the Flash Rider over so I can show you what I'm dealing with. These rubber caster wheels are completely shredded and worn down to the hard plastic. And here are the new wheels I got that are exact replacements. To remove the old caster wheels, you'll need two Allen wrenches. The longer the handle on the Allen wrench is, the better. This looks easy, but I gotta tell you that the bolts are really tight. I initially removed them off camera because I wasn't sure I was gonna be able to get these off and make this tutorial. But when it's loose, slide out the bolts. Then, with a flathead screwdriver, wedge the wheel out. And here you can get a better look at why I'm changing these out. So let's get these new caster wheels onto the flash rider. Okay, and here's one more look at these for comparison. Slide the new wheel in place and line up the center holes. Next, insert the axle bolt. You may have to fiddle with it a bit to get it all the way through. Then add the screw to the other side. And now it's time to use the two Allen wrenches to tighten the axle bolt. Once the wheel is in, it's like brand new. So now I've got one side done. Let's repeat on the other side. And just like the first wheel, this one is in really bad shape as well. So again, use one Allen wrench to hold on one side while turning with the other. I have to reiterate that these bolts are on there super tight so it's going to take some muscle to get them off. But they will come out. You just need some leverage to loosen them. These were really torqued on there. Replacing the second wheel is exactly the same as replacing the first one. The Rip Rider and Flash Rider had a really rough ride with the worn out wheels. And the old shredded wheels made a lot of noise because it was rolling on hard plastic instead of the rubber wheel. But this is an easy fix that will give your Razor, Rip Rider, or Flash Rider a new life and smoother drifting. A set of replacement wheels is about $16, and I'll list the ones I got in the description so it's easy for you to find. If this video was helpful, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all my weekly videos.